Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the My Little Pony main theme, okay? So check it out, give you a preview of what you're going to learn in today's lesson. It goes like this, check it out, so it goes like this. So here we go. Okay, so we're gonna break it up to parts that's easy to learn. We'll break it up into about, let me see, uh, four parts. Okay, here we go. So the first part goes like this right hand starts on the F sharp here, middle C, C, L for a reference. We go up an octave to this C, F sharp, that's where we start. So F sharp up to A, F sharp, E up to A, down to D, E, D, C sharp down to A. That's the right hand for the first part, okay? One more time, so it goes like this. F sharp, A, F sharp, E, up to A, down to D, E, D, C sharp, down to A. And that's it for the right hand for the first part. Once you get that right hand there, left hand, we have four chords here. The four chords are D major, which is D, F sharp, A. Second chord is E minor, which is E, G, B. Third chord is B minor, which is B, D, F sharp. And then the fourth chord is A major, which is A, C sharp, E. Okay, so with these four chords in mind, so D major, E minor, B minor, and A major, the two hands together goes like this. So F sharp and D major together, so it's together. After E, E minor by itself. D and B minor together. After C sharp, A major by itself. Just like that, okay? One more time, so it goes like this. So together, here. Together, here. Yeah, and that's it. Okay, so now moving on to the second part, right hand continues, goes B up to D, C sharp up to E, down to A, B, A. And that's it for the right hand for the second part. Okay, one more time, it goes like this, goes B, D, C sharp up to E, down to A, B, A. And that's it for the right hand for the second part. Once you get the right hand there, left hand, four chords here, the four chords are G major, which is G, B, D. Second chord is A major, which is A, C sharp, E. Third chord is B minor, which is B, D, F sharp. And then the fourth chord is A major again, which is A, C sharp, E, okay? So with these four chords in mind, G major, A major, B minor, A major, the two hands together goes like this. So B and G major together, so it's together. Alpha C sharp, A major by itself. Right, continues. A and B minor together. After A, A major by itself, like that, okay? One more time, it goes together, here, together, here. And that's it, back to back, the two parts we've learned so far will be played like this, check it out, so it goes. Yeah, so you can see like the left hand chords, you can do it one octave higher or one octave lower, it doesn't really matter, it's all the same around the piano, the chords, okay? So anyway, moving on to the third part, Okay, third part, um, let me just check. Okay, this third part is exactly the same as the first part, so awesome, we'll just repeat the first part like this. Yeah, and that's the third part, okay? So remember, third part exactly the same as the first part, you'll save some time, okay? Anyway, yeah, back to back, the three parts we've learned so far, we'll be playing like this, check it out, so. to the fourth and last part, right hand continues, goes B, C sharp, D, E, D, and that's it for the right hand. Okay, one more time, it goes B, C sharp, D, E, D, just five notes, easy, right hand. Left hand, only two chords here, finishing off, two chords are G major, which is G, B, D, and then the second chord is D major, D, F sharp, A. So you're doing these two chords already because um, they were learned throughout the other parts, okay? Anyway, with those two chords in mind, the two hands together goes like this, B and G major together. D and D major together, just like that, okay? And one more time, it goes together, together. Yeah, and that's pretty much it, okay? So back to back, all four parts will be played like this, check it out. Yeah, 
yeah, that's it. So after you got all these parts correct, all the melody and chords and also all the rhythm, when you're very comfortable with it, then you can start to add other improvisation and decoration patterns to it to make it sound more awesome, okay? In left hand, you can do more like octave and arpeggio patterns. Right hand, you can harmonize it with the chords. You can be like... Pretty much it so i hope you enjoyed this lesson if you like these step-by-step -step piano tutorials check out the rest of my channel because literally i have multiple thousands and thousands and thousands of other videos for you to enjoy and learn from so a lot of stuff and yeah that's pretty much it as for now go ahead and also check out my website bestpianomethod.com linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me learn how to play by ear improvise read sheet music and a lot of other cool stuff and yeah that's pretty much it as for now enjoy time around my channel and see you next time thanks for watching for those who want to learn my methods on how to play any song by ear, grab the free preview of my book. Or just visit my website, bestpianomethod.com, for all my other piano mastery courses, sheet music, song requests, and services. All the links are in the description below. See you next time.